Oh, tranny talk. Enough of that for now. Let's move on to Moto Madness. Now, we've talked about Yamaha, Triumph, and BMW, but we can't get very far in a discussion about motorcycles without mentioning the company that was founded in Milwaukee, Wisconsin in 1903 by William S. Harley and not one, but three Mr. Davidsons. I'm talking, of course, about Harley Davidson. Here's the 48. What better place to be to launch a brand new Harley Davidson model than at a Harley Davidson event with the big truck behind me and the wonderful new bike in front of me. It's called a 48 because 1948 was the year that Harley introduced the peanut tank, this tiny little nine liter thing that looks perfect. As a model, Harley Davidson has been making Sportster since the 50s, so it's not a new bike, it's not a new name, but the tradition goes on and the 48 is the latest evolution it's, it's a nice, comfortable, low bike, and the pricing is right. It's an entry-level pricing. So for your first Harley-Davidson, you get one of those, you get a little bit of this sexy uh, equipment, Screaming Eagle equipment on it, you get an extra, extra power that goes with it, and it makes for a very comfortable first bike. I'm not saying you're gonna go to Patagonia on it because it is not intended to be touring, especially with a nice, low rear suspension. This is a bike to pose and to ride and to have fun with relatively close to home. 